DougKimmelScout.com here with VJ Fajoko. VJ, you played a pretty good game against Washington, one of your better games of the year. Find yourself back in the starting lineup these past few weeks. Talk about your performance and then what the team needs to do better in the future. Um, I think we just need to take advantage of opportunities that we have. I mean, uh, we had a key, uh, you know, three and out. Momentum was coming our way off of a scoring drive, and uh, we ended up fumbling a punt. And, you know, just things like that we can take advantage of and it can sway the game. Um, also, we could have uh, a lot of guys uh, step up in key positions. You know, I mean, we got a young quarterback and, and some key spots, and so we need people to step up. Uh, they're young right now, but we need them to become early leaders. So there was a thought earlier this year to move you to defensive end. Now you're back at linebacker a few weeks after that. Um, talk about what your future potentially looks like at Utah. Obviously, um, you're recruited here as a linebacker. What do you need to do to become a co complete backer or D end? And what, what are you thinking about the future? Um, as far as um, and Moo goes, it was for the team at the time, and uh, and I think as far as linebacker, I think I'm, I'm a pretty complete linebacker. Uh, played against, you know, great uh, passing team, Washington State. I thought I did well, and, you know, as this past week against uh, University of Washington, who's was a running team, I uh, thought I did well as well. So um, I don't know if there's a lot of things that I could work on more than maybe maybe uh, stepping up and becoming a, a leader, a vocal leader on the field. Uh, as far as that uh, defensive end, you know, I mean, that's always been a passion of mine to rush the quarterback, so that sticks with me as well. Thanks a lot, BJ. Best of luck Saturday. Thanks.